My name's Christine Pizzi and I'm a specialist nurse and I work with the post-acute COVID assessment team. So the post-acute assessment clinic is about seeing people who are suffering from symptoms following COVID infection, usually after 12 weeks and they're still having symptoms. So people who have had um, post-acute COVID symptoms usually get referred in by the GP. The GP will refer them to our service and they will be seen by one of our clinicians. It's important that the patients have had some baseline investigations done. These would include things like chest X-ray, bloods, including BMP and ECG, because quite often the symptoms are around respiratory and cardiac. So we need to rule out that there's no other underlying cause. So when a patient's referred into our service from the GP, they would normally be contacted by our uh, team. So we have a group of people who ring and go through what we call the Yorkshire screening tool. This is a tool designed to look at what their symptoms are pre-COVID and post-COVID, and it covers a multitude of functional issues for the patient. So it might be things around breathlessness, things around um, activities of daily living, it might be about their eating and drinking. So following the Yorkshire screening tool assessment, that is triaged by our GP and the most appropriate clinician is appointed to see that patient in clinic. They're offered an appointment. So we go through an assessment with them, we do a clinical examination and we discuss with the patient several options that we can offer to help them manage those symptoms going forward. We then write to the patient detailing what we discussed and the referrals that we've done and we copy the GP into that letter so the GP is clear on what actions have been done for that patient. There's also Manchester COVID-19 peer support group that we can refer them to. It's a really useful resource for patients. So if you have had COVID infection and you feel that you're suffering from long COVID symptoms, please contact your GP, make them aware of the service and ask to be referred in because we can support you with these symptoms and the life debilitating symptoms and we do have the resources here in Salford to support you going forward and hopefully improve your life.